Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial. We are going to demonstrate a program that uh, we have two value use and we are going to find out which one is maximum and the result it appear in this. For this you are going to start a program and uh, uh, use it as template and then uh, it appear a panel and uh, as like as before you can uh, use a uh, callback function uh, panel CB and the name is panel and you can change the uh, title as something here and I haven't done it and you are going to uh, add three uh, numeric here one one two and three and a button you are going to have a, a button uh, here uh, toggle button you can have it that button and right click and uh, change the uh, label on that you are going to use and here label you are going to write max and uh, you are uh, going to use it uh, calculate max as callback function and you can name it call max and uh, and these they are uh, I have uh, call it u and uh, it is u value callback and the uh, default value zero and it is float variable with minus infinite to plus infinite and increment with one and then uh, you can see the preview here and the label is u here okay the same for the, the others and then uh, you have a quit button here and uh, in uh, C file when you when you here under code generate main function and then generate all callbacks and in C it creates both C and the header file and you are going to add the toolbox.h and then uh, you are going to use a variable, global variable, float my max, float x or float y, and it is a function. And in uh, main, you must see that everything is correct. And then uh, in uh, panel callback, uh, you can use this or what it is, the standard switch event and event close you are putting this function and in callback u value uh, you don't do anything ev value you don't do anything in res value you don't do anything but e call max when you press on the calculate max uh, you are defining three variables of float u v and res and you are switching the event if it is commit it means that you have pressed the uh, max uh, button uh, you are going to get the value from you uh, uh, <coughs> uh, the first numeric and put it in the address of you and get it the value from the second numeric and put it in the address of v and you are going to uh, put the result equals and call the uh, my max function and then you are going to put the result in the uh, third uh, in the third uh, numeric and in quit button if, uh, when you press on quit it means event commit and you are putting this function and in my max float my max function you are going to use a float max if x bigger than y max equals x else max equal y or you can use it instead of use it another variable 
if x is this, uh, bigger than y, return x, else return y. And uh, it is all. And we are going to run. And I am going to use it uh, 50.47 and here 60.78 calculate max and V is bigger and it is the result and you are going to use minus 15.1 and you have a minus 16.8 and the maximum is u and you are going to use uh, 67 and here uh, minus 9 and this one is bigger okay it was all in this tutorial see you on next tutorial